Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new. Today we're gonna be talking about safety procedures, but before we get into that, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button, that notification bell, so you don't miss any more videos here on out. Now that we've gotten that out of the way, let's get started. When it comes to soap making, safety should always be your top priority. Working with lye, a caustic substance, requires proper precautions to ensure the well-being of the soap maker, which is you. In this video, we're going to discuss the importance of safety with working with lye and explain some specific safety precautions that soap makers should follow. First and foremost, it is critical to understand the importance of safety when working with lye. Lye, also known as sodium hydroxide, is a highly caustic substance that can cause severe burns and other injuries if it's not handled properly. It's essential to respect the power of lye and take the appropriate measures to protect yourself during the soap making process. Let's now discuss specific soap making procedures that soap makers should follow. First, always wear appropriate protective gear. This includes gloves, goggles, and long sleeves. These items help prevent direct contact with lye, and it minimizes the risk of burns and other skin irritation. Also critical to work in a well-ventilated area or have a dehumidifier. Lye releases fumes that can be harmful when you inhale, so it's very important that you ensure there is proper air circulation. This can be achieved by working near an open window or having a dehumidifier, which is a ventilation of the air, or working outdoors when weather permits. Please, please, please understand this. When you are handling lye, always remember to add it to your water using a strainer. Do not do it the other way around. Adding water to lye can cause a violent reaction. Think of a volcano exploding, resulting in splatting and potentially causing chemical skin burns. Pour your lye slowly into your water through a strainer while slowly mixing it. Ensure that the mixture is well combined. Proper cleanup is equally important as well. After working with lye, thoroughly clean all your equipment and surfaces that have come in contact with it. Rinse all your tools with plenty of water to neutralize any lye that is left over. And use appropriate cleaning agents to ensure a clean, safe environment. By following these safety procedures, soap makers can minimize the risk associated with working with lye and you create a safe soap making environment. Remember, safety should always come first to protect yourself and those around you. Thank you for watching today's video on the importance of safety when working with lye in the soap making process. I hope that today's video has been helpful and informative in your soap making journey. If you enjoyed today's video, give it a thumbs up and leave a comment sharing your thoughts and any additional safety tips you may have. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more information for soap making tips, inspiration, and tutorials. To stay in the loop so you don't miss any more videos from here on out, hit that notification bell. Your support means the world to us at Artistry Lather, and we appreciate you being a part of our soap making community. Once again, thank you for watching today's video, so I want you to stay safe, take care, and happy soap making.